All right, welcome back. So now we're going to go ahead after the, um, after the unboxing in the last video, we're going to go ahead and do the new T-Mobile Home Internet Plus mesh system. So if you're ready, let's jump right into this video. So to start up, we have to get the gateway set up and then hook this, set this up. Get all this out the way. Throw that in the bag. Are y'all excited for this one? Because I show him I'm ready for this thing to work like it's supposed to. Hopefully this solves all my internet connection problems with my TVs, my cellular devices, uh, anything that's connected to home Wi-Fi. My camera, my doorbell, all that good stuff. You know what I'm saying. You know what I mean, right? So let's get all these wires hooked up. I bought this little thing at the Dollar Tree. Uh, I like these little things. They come in very handy when you don't need a real long extension cord, but you need that extra connection to your outlet. All right, let me let me just shut up. Uh, I have a tendency to ramble a little bit, but some people like it, some people don't. Booyah. Come on, man. Let's get this box set up. These people are ready to see what's going on. They're ready to see the setup. Setup is always a headache, don't you think? Having to do all this, especially when you are stuck in this little small corner of the room. There you go rambling again. You think they want to hear that? Y'all don't want to hear that, huh? You don't want to hear that, right? Nobody wants to hear rambling. Let's get this thing all set up. I'm going to leave the plastic on it for right now. You heard me? Uh, so, I'm not going to actually have the mesh in this room. I'm going to have it in a different room. So, I forgot I don't have to hook up the wire in here. But I still have to use, I still have to set it up in here uh, onto the router. So, here we go. So actually, I'm not going to put the kickstand on because I have it in the window. I was just thinking about that. Uh, I don't really need it to turn unless I, I decide to have it somewhere else in the house. But uh, I'll still have it if I wind up moving or something like that. So hopefully that everything works out with this one. So we got to connect the LAN on this one. So we'll hook the other end into the mess. Wait, let me see, make sure I have it in. What line I have it in. I don't know. Yeah, we, we hooked up in LAN 1. LAN 1. On the bottom of the router. I noticed this one don't have a... Uh, I didn't see a power button in the back of this one. Like the old one. So we're gonna hook that onto level, hook that into land one. My best spot in the house. All right. Let's plug it in. So 
a bunch of wires, man. Get this out of the way. There we go. Nice little LED light at the bottom, letting you know that it's powered on. So we have to scan this Wi-Fi mesh access point uh, setup information guide. So I have to scan this QR code to set up the mesh. So we got to scan this little barcode. Trying to get me to install T Life. I don't want to install T Life. I already have T Mobile, but T Mobile does the same thing as T Life. T Mobile, why are y'all confusing us with, with all these apps that do the same thing? And they pretty much look alike. Don't be 20 years. You notice when you want to show somebody something? Things have a tendency to go very slow, or you can't find it, or it just doesn't act right. Well, that's what's going on right now. We're almost there. We're almost there. 40, 59%. Come on. Let's go. Looks like we got three bars. Okay, open. Finally. I don't need to know all that. The Wi Fi is upgraded and is doing a firmware update right now. Which that's pretty, that's the fastest I've ever seen an up, upgrade do. Update do. Not upgrade, update do. You, you know what I mean? Uh, T Mobile's. Now let's set up your Wi Fi access point. Let's go. Here's what's in the box. I already know Wi Fi access point, internet care, power adapter. Looks good. You'll find the QR code on the back of the access point. Scan QR code. All right, so now we have to scan this one. Let's position. Let's position your Wi Fi access point. Find the halfway point between your gateway and the area with the least Wi Fi coverage or where you use the internet the most, like an office. Like Power on your Wi Fi access point. We'll finish your setup in the background. This process could take up to five minutes. Feel free to use your phone. We'll let you know when it's complete. Got it. You are now managing 5G gateway. I didn't think it was going to take this long to get this thing set up, but you always know anything new, uh, especially if you haven't messed with it before, it can be kind of challenging. So. I appreciate you sticking with me, uh, getting this thing set up. All right, so we power it on, tap to connect. We're online, we had to reboot the router. And the mesh is the turn from red to white to green. So green means ready, I'm guessing. T-Mobile finishing setup for a T-Mobile Wi-Fi access point. Now, once this is set up, I can unplug it, go plug it up somewhere else in the house, and get a wider coverage, uh, extended uh, coverage throughout the whole house. So the router will be here, and the mesh will be on the other side of the house. T-Mobile Wi-Fi access. All right. As you see, 
the router is now connected to the mesh. So we're good to go. Uh, once I get everything set up, I'll do it in the next video. Uh, so I'll see you in the next one. Peace.